Hey guys, Kate here. I'm going to talk a little bit about how to clear mental clutter. Now what is mental clutter? It's clutter that comes from other people's negativity. <laughs> and it's also clutter from not having a set schedule. So for example, if you're somebody that worries a lot and you have all of these thoughts that are constantly in your mind about what do I do about finances? What do I do about my kids? What do I do about dating? And you're constantly thinking about all these things that are worrying you. That is mental clutter. Now, here's a question for you. How are you going to clear out your mental clutter? I have a couple suggestions. Now, I want you to take a piece of paper and write down any thoughts or impressions that come to mind as you listen to this video and you'll be surprised on what you can change. So first off, with mental clutter, it is important that we first use self-will, love, and patience in order to change. In order for us to change our subconscious thoughts about worries, fears, anxieties, it is so, so important that we use our conscious thoughts to change our subconscious minds. Now in order to do that, what I want to invite you to do is actually have a set time for a couple of weeks and let's say on Sunday from 9 until 10 o'clock in the morning, that is your worry time. Because I guarantee you, maybe throughout the week you've spent about five hours worrying about this and that. Why don't you actually set up a time to actually worry about those things that you feel are worth worrying over? So if you do that, then when worrying thoughts come to your mind throughout the week, you can say, nope, this is not the time for worry. Worry is on Sunday from 9 to 10. <laughs> and when you do that, you'll have a set time where you can actually create solutions for those things that are worrying you. So Sunday from 9 to 10, what you could do is take out a piece of paper, write down the things that are worrying you, and then go through and find out how you can actually find solutions. Now, if you're interested in listening to a video about how to find solutions to the things that are worrying you, let me know in the comments and I'll definitely do one of those for you guys. Another way to clear mental clutter is to use appropriate verbiage. Now, there are words that I call yes, yes words. And those words are I can, I do, I can remember, and I love myself. Those words can create a lot of power in your life. On the other hand, if you're sitting there going, I can't, I'm trying, I can't remember, I can't do this, I don't know. Those are no-no words and they're going to wreck your life. So I want you to just pause the video and write down what are no-no words for you and what are your yes-yes words. And then every time you catch yourself thinking or saying out loud a no-no word, all you have to do is correct it through self-love, patience, and self-will. That is so simple just to clear out your mental clutter. And if you like this video, go ahead and share with your friends. Please let me know in the comments down below how you're gonna apply this into your life today. Not a week from now, not in two years from now, but today. Now, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time in my next video. Thanks, bye.